Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. Panda's controller might have been too good to be true because the official Kickstarter has closed. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, earlier on this month, I posted a video about Panda's Kickstarter. It was for a controller that was fully customizable and compatible with the Nintendo GameCube and Switch and also with the PC. If you want to check out that video, I'll leave a link in the description below. Now to say people were excited about this controller would be a pretty massive understatement. The campaign was initially seeking $100,000 and they raised almost 2 million overall, 1.9 million to be precise. So this campaign in its short time that it was up raised quite a bit of money, a crazy amount of money. You might be asking yourself then, why was it cancelled? Well, fortunately here, Panda has been pretty transparent about the entire thing, and it's not nearly as bad as you would think. I'm going to leave a link to their update in the description below and feel free to check it out. So at a really high level here, basically the Kickstarter was a lot more popular than they thought it was going to be, and they identified some production timeline issues. They couldn't guarantee a delivery date of December 2022, and instead of holding on to everybody's money for an indefinite period of time, they decided just to cancel the Kickstarter altogether. It's not all doom and gloom though, because they are still continuing production of this controller just on their own outside of Kickstarter. In fact, they're expanding their team right now for a lead electrical hardware engineer, which will probably help out with that new controller. With the Kickstarter being closed, I'm kind of wondering what will happen with the ideas behind these stretch goals. Obviously the stretch goals no longer exist because the campaign doesn't exist, but I'm wondering if they take some of these ideas and try to mold them into the final product. So at the end of the day here, while Panda canceling the Kickstarter might seem like it sucks, it really doesn't change anything. They're still making the controller, there's still a production issue whether or not there was a Kickstarter, and you will be able to pick up the controller whenever it's released. Anyways, that is all I've got for this video. Let me know your thoughts about the Panda controller in the comments below. And let me know your thoughts about the Kickstarter in the comments below. Did you back this? Were you planning on backing it? Or now are you just going to wait until the controller is actually released? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button. Check out my other videos. Thank you, everyone. Take care.